Hi everybody, today I'm going to teach you how to make a mojito originating in Havana, Cuba. It was a supposed favorite of Ernest Hemingway who helped to popularize the drink when he went to a local grocer which served it. Uh, that's as far as I am aware of the legend, but today I'm going to teach you how to make it. So it's pretty basic. You have mint leaves, white rum, uh, seltzer water, simple syrup, and lime. And a lime, a real lime. Okay, so before we get started with the actual cocktail, you're gonna to wanna to chill your glass. And I'm using a Collins glass. It's a tall, thin glass, which is perfect for summertime drinks with a lot of ice. I have crushed ice right here. And you're gonna to wanna to fill your glass about two thirds of the way up. Oops. That was supposed to happen. And of course you want to avoid making any messes when you're working at a bar. So don't do that. Okay, so now we're gonna take our glass and set it aside. It's just gonna chill for a few minutes. And you can then begin the cocktail. It's gonna use two ounces of white rum and it's gonna go right into a muddling glass, which is presented right here. Get this ice cleaned up. Oh my god. Okay, so the next thing we're gonna do is take our lime, we're gonna cut it in half, and before you cut any citrus, you're gonna wanna roll it with your hand. And that should be sufficient. So you're gonna cut your lime directly in half, and then you're gonna cut it into quarters. Like so. Then you're gonna take your limes and just plop them right inside your muddling glass. And so at this point, your cocktail should look like this. Just rum and lime. Of course, it needs a little sweetener, so we're gonna use some simple syrup. And that's gonna be three quarters of an ounce. So what we're gonna do right now is muddle, which is uh, basically smashing all the ingredients together to break apart the citrus oils and blend it as much as we can. So you're gonna take a muddler, which looks like this, and just begin pressing gently. And you can get pretty rough with the lime at this point. So you're gonna take your fresh mint and pick off about 10 leaves. The larger, the better. Yep, you're gonna wanna be super gentle. Okay, so now that you've muddled, you're gonna wanna add one ice cube and let your cocktail steep for about a minute. So, we got a whole minute. A whole minute. That's close enough, good enough. All right, so now that it's been steeped for a whole minute, you're going to want to strain it into your Tom Collins glass. I'm gonna use a Hawthorne strainer, which looks like this. Pop it right in your muddling glass. You could double strain this if you like, Personally, I like a little bit of pulp in my cocktails, so we're just gonna use the Hawthorne strainer. And our last ingredient is gonna be one ounce of seltzer water. I don't have a bottle opener, so I'm just gonna flick the cap off. 
That hurt quite a bit. And we're gonna use one ounce, like I said before. And now your cocktail is almost complete. You're gonna to wanna to use a little spoon to just mix it a little bit. Get the seltzer mixed throughout the cocktail. And the last thing you're gonna to wanna to do is take a sprig of mint and place it inside the glass. Some people like to slap it to release the oils, but this is presentable and I like to keep the leaves as fresh as possible. So once the mint's in there, you can just take your straw, like so, plop it right in and there you go. That's a summertime classic, the mojito from Havana, Cuba. Mm. Getting drunk tonight. Cheers. This episode is brought to you by GoodSpiritsNews.com, one of the leading resources for alcohol on the internet.